So I'm back, and today Rangers drew nothing each with FK Scooping, which means we're through to the next round of the Europa League on aggregate. So it was quite a boring game, if I'm honest. Uh, not much really happened. We didn't have too much threat going forward. We did have a few shots. Tavernier had a, a free kick, and Windass had quite a good shot that was saved. But apart from that, nothing really even happened. There was a lot of poor retention of the ball. Um, just bad touches, bad passes, bad decisions. A lot was going on in the middle of the park. Not a lot of it good. Um, but the main concern probably was the forward line. Not, I've, it was like watching the third division. No desire to go forward. No desire to break a line. No desire to shoot. Even and when there was desire to shoot, it was a hideous shot. Not much was going on in the forward line. But what we do have to be happy about is the part of the team where Gerard worked on the defence. The defence looked really, really good. Um, and the goalkeeper, McGregor looked good, Katic looked good, Goldson looked good. I thought they were fantastic for the whole game. Um, Flanagan got done in the last minute, but he, overall he looked good. Tavernier, as I said, had a free kick and he was swinging in crosses for a lot of the first half and he looked great. Um, Jack in midfield looked good. McCrory was a bit shaky for me, but I don't, I'm not here to criticise. It is quite early in the season. It's two games and Maybe by the end of the next round, if he isn't playing that well, then I'll start to worry. But it's the same with the attacking uh, side of the game. But on the bright side for the attackers, well, not for Alfredo Morelos, you'd assume, but we do have Umar Sadiq. He will be available, as I understand, for the next round, which is good. Um, if Umar Sadiq is the answer to our attacking problems, then fantastic. But another guy who might be the answer to our attacking problems is Ejaria. Ejaria looked quite good when he came on. Um, he wasn't as sloppy as the rest of the team. And he did look quite forward-thinking, like Middleton. Middleton also looked quite forward-thinking. So while it is a bit early for me to criticise, well, it's a bit early for everyone to criticise, I think. I think you could justify it on this game just by how little we, we threatened them. But... Overall, we're through, so I can't really complain about that. Having said that, though, if we are, you know, shaky going forward in the next round, that is a real concern, and it won't go well for us if we go to Aberdeen like that, because they will hand us a scalping if we do that. But, uh, yeah, good, good result, I suppose, but, uh, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye.